two floors to get to the cargo bay leading up to docking. Get a move on. Invaded the station. God, that sounds absurd, considering we were working here side by side only a week ago. Everything has changed since. They're pushing the army and us civilians with them further and further towards the mined out caverns. When I mentioned to one of the officers that they should try to break through one of the landing bays and, and try to launch some of the people in supply freighters, he barked back that if I want to be flattened by Vor's airstrikes, I can go right ahead. And when I insisted, he bashed me hard across my face. I don't really blame him. He's, he's just a kid who thought doing jumping jacks on some off-world colony would be as good an alternative to hanging around that decaying planet of ours. It's time to do something more productive than waiting around to be shot. bonus. Can you restart them? Manual override, as in with a blunt instrument directly to the console? Oh. Knock, knock. Release 
the tower's docking plant. Imagination, Buster Brown. The hell are you supposed to be, Fatso? The last line of defense before we send the mothership to Kingdom Come. <laughs> Looks more like the local pisshead, if you ask me. Kick your small fleshy ass. You can barely lift your leg.
Where's the insertion port? Exhaust port. As in engine, exhaust port? I didn't get all the way here to end up as fried chicken. I'm not about to lose this fight now, either. The board's overheated the thrusters trying to break from the gravity vortex. Shake a leg and the only thing you'll have to worry about is a sauna treatment. It's been three... No, four days since we hit away. The board's have taken over most of Prometheus 1 now. Mopping up any stragglers left and tearing out our hardware. Probably to install theirs. Going back and forth between thinking whether any of my friends and colleagues made it, and how tired and hungry I am. Karka, on the other hand, remains calm and dispassionate, like a Buddhist monk knowing that Nirvana may be just around the corner. When I asked her about it, she said it's time we acted. After much debate, we've decided to use body bags to board the mothership. The Vors avoid interacting with the dead as much as possible, so we... We should make it. Once on board, we'll, we'll attempt to get to Kataka's private lab and, and send out an SOS from there. You think I'm crazy for doing something like this, but it's better than sitting around starving. And Earth needs to know what's happening here.